and welcome back. <laughs> so my setup is a little bit different. Normally I'm sitting here at the desk doing my makeup and the camera is on this side so you're seeing the black wall over here. But I wanted to do it a little bit different because I'm doing a totally different video today. I'm doing a clothing makeup accessory haul. Like it's a lot. But it's everything that I got for my birthday basically and then maybe a couple things here and there that I just got on my own, new that I have, and if you're interested in buying it, I'll link all of the prices and everything in the description, and I'll try and give you the prices by memory, some I don't really remember, but I'm going to start with all of my clothes, and then I'll do the makeup and shoes after. Okay, so the first store is H&M, and I was so excited to see this little fur teddy here. It was $50. You see Kila? It was $50, and I know that the... Kila, stop! This little fur jacket is like really in style right now. I was so excited to find it. It just feels so soft and so warm. I don't know how many times I'm gonna be able to wear it just because it's so hot outside, but I was really excited to find it at H&M. Okay, the next thing was this Nirvana hoodie. This was in the guy section, but I got this um, to wear to my birthday dinner because I kind of wanted like an oversized hoodie to wear with the little tight shorts and some boots. And I have those things also to show you guys. Um, and I'll put, I'll insert a picture here so you can see like what my outfit was like. But I wore this with um, some little hoops, a necklace, the shorts that I was telling you about, and the boots. And it was really cute. I was really happy about my outfit this night. <laughs> and I think this was $35. Okay, so the last thing I got at H&M was this little crop hoodie here. And I feel like this is so cute and sporty and I want to wear this with like some high-rise jeans or the gauchos that I'm about to show you too. I just like, I love this. And this was $25. Um, so the stuff that I got at Forever, I only got three things. The first thing is this cute little mustard beanie. I have just been into this color. I don't know why, but I want everything in this color. It's just so cute. Okay, I got this sweater here. This I think was only $20 and it's just a very soft, like, I don't know. I just love everything about this sweater. I love the colors here. I love that it comes all the way up to the neck and it's a little bit shorter than a regular sweater, but I just love this so much. And I have paired it with these pants right here. These are just some denim gauchos. They're cut off at the bottom. These are an extra small and the waist fits me perfectly. I have the hardest time fitting into pants that are not fitted jeans because the waist is always too big. All right, these two things I got at Urban Outfitters. These jeans here were in the sale, the clearance section, they were $30. They're extra high rise, so they go above my belly button. They fit me really good, and I love that the bottom, the bottom is cut off here. I feel like the color is just perfect. Urban Outfitters has been having some good sale section, really. And then I got this little baby doll dress. This, again, is in that mustard color that I love. So this dress was originally $50, and I got it with 40% off. Okay, so... I got these two boots. This my sister gifted to me for my birthday. This is from the boutique that she works at. She's a manager at Laura Nicole. It's a boutique downtown Orlando and they are amazing. They are just so like, these are the best boots I've ever seen. They're so amazing, so cool. They're like a purplish maroon but with the black stripes in it, it makes it look like a purple. They're just so different and so cool and I can't wait to wear these like all the time. So these were the boots that I wore on my birthday. They're kind of like a, the sock boot. Um, I got these at Forever 21. These were I think $35 and I love them. They're not the most comfortable things ever. I wore these probably for like four hours on my birthday. And by the end of the night my feet were cramping. <laughs> They're really cute but they hurt a lot. So that's kind of it with all of my clothes. I want to talk about this cup. So they have these little plastic cups at Starbucks for $3. Whenever you buy these cups and you bring them into Starbucks to get your drink, you get 10% off. And also, it's just reusable. You can use it at home. And I, have, I used to have a cup that I used all the time and it broke. So I've been looking for a cup and I'm just so happy to have this cup. <laughs> I love it. I 
actually forgot about this, but I went to Paxton and I got this hat here. It was 50% off, so it was $12. Um, I love this. I feel like you could wear it so many different ways with your hair down. You can wear it with like a little small bun in the back or like a low pony. And then these were the shorts that I wore with that sweatshirt on my birthday. So I wore this, that sweatshirt, and the black boots. I felt good. <laughs> so these are Brandy Melville and they were $16. Okay, so I have a little, quite a bit of makeup, but the first thing that I will talk about is the Too Faced Gingerbread Palette. These colors are like totally me. This hot pink right here, but it smells so weird. It smells like Play-Doh. This smells like Play-Doh. I think they kind of missed the mark with the gingerbread, but okay the colors are amazing it's what I'm wearing on my eyes and then the spiked eggnog this really pretty gold right here is what I've used as my highlight and then I also used it as my brow bone highlight too okay so I got two concealers these are not new for me I have used this one for a while this is so I got this soft matte NARS concealer I use this as my eyeshadow base and also to carve out my eyebrows this is in the shade custard so it's medium one and then also I feel like there's nothing to really say about this concealer. It's just the best. Everyone knows it, so that's why. Okay, so I basically just restocked up on the Bare Minerals Fair Pro Foundation. I've been using this for a while. It's one of my favorites. I feel like it's perfect for my skin type. I have been combination recently, which is so weird. I've always been, I don't know, honestly, I just feel like my skin has changed so much in the last couple of years, but this has been really good for me because it's a very natural finish. It's not super matte and it's not dewy, which is perfect for me. I want something that really just looks like my skin and I feel like this gives me that. It's a perfect color for me. Um, this is in Sable. I stand by this foundation. I've told my family and all of my friends that this foundation is just so good. I love it. Okay, so I have two new lipsticks. This one is my Velvet Teddy. It's my favorite lipstick ever. I've talked about it so much, I have just restocked because I ran out. And then this one I got, I've never used before. It's the ABH Spice Lipstick. And it's similar to Velvet Teddy. It's just a little bit more brown. It reminds me of Whirl from MAC, but maybe not so brown. It's just a really good, um, shade for me when I'm a little bit more tan. It's what I have on my lips right now, so it's kind of my substitute when I'm not as light to wear the Velvet Teddy, because Velvet Teddy can look very pink if I'm a little bit more tan, so this has been really good. Okay, so I have two primers. This um, Makeup Forever Step 1 Smoothing Primer I've used before. I used to use it all the time and I just stopped, I don't know why, but I rebought it because I've been so oily around my nose here and this just gives you such a smooth, I feel like it just smooths out my pores and makes my foundation lay really nice on my skin. So that's why I got this and I feel silly for buying this because after I tried the NYX Angel Veil Primer, it's like the same thing. <laughs> This is $15. This is $30. This, I feel like, is the exact same thing. So if you're looking for something that's really smoothing, not super expensive, I would try the Angel Veil. It's really good. Okay, so the last thing that I'm going to talk about is this Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. And I know that everyone is pretty much using this spray just because of, like, you'll see how fine the mist is. It just smells so good, like so fresh and clean that you don't mind like spraying your face for five minutes with it. Um, it's just really good. It makes your makeup last a long time, but it does, I will say, make you very dewy, which is not my thing, so I only use a little bit just to set all my foundation and everything, all of the powders together with my foundation. So if you're looking for a setting spray, this is $15. You can get it at Ulta or you can get it online. So. That's that. Okay, so I think that's everything. I This is probably, I think this is my third or fourth time filming it because the audio has been so bad. So I'm hoping when I go to edit this, it's not, it doesn't suck. 
But thank you so much for being here. I love you guys. I'm so grateful that you watch my videos. If you're not subscribed, I would love for you to subscribe. You know what to do. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.